Three is your back to school authority and students of all ages are getting ready to hit the books again. For some, it's an exciting time, but for others, it can be riddled with anxiety. Channel 3 Waterbury Bureau Chief Dennis Valera spoke with a doctor at Connecticut Children's. He explains what parents should keep in mind to make sure their kids are healthy as they head back to school. Back to school is always a time of transition. Whether it's going up the next grade, up to high school or even college, Dr. Robert Ketter, a developmental behavioral pediatrician at Connecticut Children's says the transition back can be an anxious one. To best get your kids in back to school mode, start getting them back on their school sleeping routine and other habits. Trying to get kids um, back in the habit of packing a school bag or packing a lunch, um, having clothing ready maybe the night before, uh, and getting ready to get up and out in the morning is a big change. This fall will mark the first school year without mask mandates in the pandemic from the start. With some students certain to still mask up, Dr. Ketter says it's best for all parents to just normalize masking. Some kids are anxious without their mask. Some feel anxious about being the child with the mask. I think what's really important is, is that we help a child understand right what we need for the situation, but that we also help children understand that it's okay, um, that if people do want to wear a mask, that that's fine. This will also be the first school year where all school-age children are eligible for COVID vaccines. Dr. Ketter says the science and data is clear. It's safe to get, and he recommends children to get it, as well as catch up on other routine immunizations like the MMR vaccine. Those are still lagging in this pandemic. And we do know that the, the FDA tends to be more protective with children. So anything that is approved for children, we ethically want to make sure we're jumping through those extra hoops and making sure that we're protecting and being safe with kids. A good way to get your kids ready for school is focusing on the good things. With the ongoing pandemic, inflation and other economic issues, it can be a lot for students of all ages to deal with and understand. Dr. Ketter says it's good to amp up what your kids are excited for this fall. And that's, you know, looking forward to coming back to meeting with some good friends at school or connecting with that great teacher or guidance counselor or adult that you really connect with at school. Um, or it could even be a coach or sports team or something like that too. So we just want to help kids feel like they're, they're in control when there are times where it feels a little out of control. Another tip from Dr. Ketter, maybe set up an optional orientation with your kid's school. That can get the first day jitters out of the way and help with the transition. Dennis Valera, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.